We've yeah. got the Dragon Realms dice boxes and trays. Oh, these are intriguing. Mm. Tell us what's yeah. happening here, Ben. So these are from Z1 Designs, uh, designed by John Steins, and this is a set of stuff for your role-playing games. Funnily, we've got quite a role-playing theme here today, apparently, but uh, <laughs> it might just be because it's me. <laughs> but yes, so there's a range of uh, dice boxes and dice trays that you can use for your role-playing. Each of them is designed using wood and leather. They've got the amazing sort of like dragon scale designs on the top of them with those wonderful eyes on them yes. as well, which is absolutely fantastic. It gives you the idea that they've almost, they're almost like enchanted objects of their own, which is really cool. Inside each of the different dice boxes you've got space for all your dice so your or your poly dice there's also a space for your miniature as well which is really fantastic and now of course you've got the big dice tray there as well which allows you to use on this in the gaming table with everyone else around you as well which is really cool <coughs> they've got a whole bunch of different um, sort of embossed designs and stuff that they've been working with so you can have swords and all kinds of different things on there there's like an idrasil design as well which is really cool and one of the other big things they've been doing Unfortunately, at this point, the early bird offer for the miniature will have passed, uh, uh, which is a shame. But Z1 Designs are actually going to be working on this sort of like range of NPC miniatures in the future as well. So I believe one of the ones they were showing off as part of the Kickstarter was uh, the Blacksmith miniature. But they're actually going to be doing a lot more of these in the future, which is really, really cool to see down the road. So it's something to look out for if you want to follow Z1 Designs on Facebook and all that kind of things as well. But yeah, just a really nice little interesting one showing off some very, very nice artisanal work on some really cool things that people want to sort of bling up uh, their D and D sessions because obviously as, as tabletop gamers we love collecting things like dice and, and all kinds of different accessories like tokens all those mm. kind of things like that when we're collecting our stuff for our armies to theme things together and a lot of the things that role players do is they love collecting things like dice bags and pouches and all those kind of things so mm. if you like your D&D and you like your role playing in general maybe go and check these out there's some really cool designs for things like um, Cthulhu as well so if you like that kind of things as well there's, there's options for you there which is really nice so yeah mm. go and check this one out yeah cool it's one I really like the look of and uh, for me, it would be multi-purpose because I could definitely see myself using one or two of those pieces for my LARP characters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, just just as little containers. Maybe my LARP character also likes to play role-playing games. There you go. <laughs> they were getting meta. Oh, no, hang on, hang on. Wait, wait, wait. Are you, you're you're going to eat RPG in a LARP? Yeah, why not? Harry Dresden likes to role-play yeah. in the Dresden Files. So, yeah. yeah, we're good. <laughs> Okay, we, we've managed to do a mind melter without doing a mind melter segment. Justin.exe <laughs> has failed to load. Please contact your service administrator. 